Okay, let's have people have a fun today. So today I'm going to compare the Pick Z and the uh, uh, GNU Zip to see which one is faster on my Raptor computing Blackbird system. Uh, if you haven't heard about this workstation, it is a IBM Power9 workstation. I'm using the uh, the one uh, uh, this right here got 32 core and each of the th sorry 32 thread and uh, they run at the 3.8 gigahertz. They can turbo all the way to 4.5 gigahertz. Uh, I'm running the Fedora of Linux 40. It's a bit like edgy, but so far pretty stable. Kernel 6.5 and uh, running a 64 kg page size. Now uh, you can see here this is my B top and it show. 32 thread as you can see here right um, the experiment is simple I have this table file here of my pillar of eternity game uh, let's see if I can uh, compress this file um, so the first the first one I want to try is uh, gzip so we're gonna time it right so I'm gonna try the fast compression right and see how long it's gonna take Okay, probably have to uh, fast winding this because I know for 15 gigabyte it's going to take very long time. Um, so few things I want to point out is gzip uh, does not take advantage of the full uh, available core. So you can see here right now it's only cut up by two thread going here, which is one core, which is very bad. So the first one has finished the take six minutes roughly about six minutes uh, and uh, 3.679 second and let's see what is the size of the file the size of the file sorry here is 7.3 here next one choose the best this one going to take much much longer time uh, again, I want to iterate that um, gzip doesn't take full advantage of all available cores. Uh, the gzip batch uh, scenario is, has completed. It takes it has taken thirty one minutes and forty nine seconds. Uh, the size is seven gigabyte, which is about three hundred uh, megabyte smaller than the fast one. Next is to run the pick z. Uh, with a fast uh, compression. So let's see. Now, I want to point out is Big Z is amazing. It's utilized all of available core uh, and I have 32 thread here and all of them you can see are being utilized right now as this, this thing's run. So just look at this. Amazing. Now imagine if you have multiple CPU IBM Power9 give you like 100, 200, 300, 400 thread at your disposal. How fast it would be? Look at this. Look at this. It took unbelievably fast. 29 seconds. How, how was that? 29 seconds. And the size is the same, 7.3 uh, gigabyte, right? So I'm going to load up the best compression that I expect will take a bit longer. Okay, look at this. It kicks in straight away. All of the 32 thread are being utilized right now. And I would expect this might take uh, another, another minute or two. So this time with the best compression, it takes uh, roughly two minutes, two minutes, right? Uh, yeah, two minutes roughly. I'm not so sure why I say 51 minute here, but this is definitely two minutes. And the size the same to that of uh, uh, GNU Zip. Our experiment, in conclusion, I can see that uh, Pick Z is much, much way, way faster than the GNU Zip. 
So the kazoo zip with the fast one takes six minutes and uh, uh, the best one took about 31 minutes, which is really slow. The pig zip fast is uh, 0.29, like 29 seconds. So that is like about through 2,300% uh, faster than uh, that of a uh, uh, zip counterpart. Uh, and the same for the big Z bass as well. This one uh, takes uh, two minutes uh, instead of uh, 31 minutes, sorry. Uh, and again, yeah, on average, the same, uh, same game uh, in, in the time. Uh, take much, 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 much less time um, to, uh, to produce the end result. Um, the size-wise, the same, not much difference. Um, you can see that data produces the same uh, result. 7.3 for the fast and uh, for the best uh, compression is 7 gig. Um, so if you have lots of core for your machine, I highly recommend you take advantage of PigZ. Uh, I hope you enjoy this quick uh, experiment video and if you have any question, feel free to let me know. I'll see you in the next video.